What's going on guys? Jay that drain guy. Try not to get run over. So we're in an apartment building and we've got this clean out that's leaking. Uh, possibly it is clogged. Um, so we're gonna open it up. We're using our little Nipix Cobra here. Uh, I think these are the six inch. So, you guys can see the little tip uh, or the uh, the wing or the ear or whatever you want to call it is broken off this one. That's why they have the big washer. Let's see if I can grab you guys to take a look. All right. Actually, I wonder. Let's see if I can get you guys in a better position. So the blockage wasn't right here at the connection. So we're thinking it's probably going to be down at the wall. Yeah, just don't run me over, please. Thanks. <laughs> All right. So we're going to hook up another couple cables. So we got 15 feet in so far. I got another 30 feet coming up the ladder with me. That should put us at that connection. Now the only thing we need to worry about is not getting run over. All right, here comes the car. We're hoping she don't run me over. So this is 22 and a half feet right here. Yeah, so we got the water draining. Let's see if I can get you guys. So we're going to pull it right out, see if we got anything. That's seven and a half. That's 15. It's 22 and a half. That's 30. Thirty-seven and a half. Uh, looks like we got some sort of wipe or something.
Also maybe some floss. So it's probably all getting caught at a connection, probably at that 30 foot mark. We're gonna go back in, snake it one more time, and then we're good to go. So here's that 30 foot mark. Just need to take off all the stuff that I just Just a heads up guys, never stand on the top of a ladder. I'm clearly not setting a good example. You know what, while we're up here and you guys are looking at the Watson gloves, let's give them a huge shout out. Thanks a lot guys, I really do appreciate you guys creating good gloves like this. Um, these were not sent to me, this is not a promotion. I just like to thank the people that make my job easier. I wanna thank Steve and John for being channel members as well. Thank you guys. You guys stuck around this long and I really do appreciate it. Thanks a lot guys. We're stuck boys. Maybe we got more stuff on the cable. No, nothing really. Throw that down there. Then I'm gonna come back and do this up. I'm just gonna grab the machine and take it down as well. Everything looks like it's running good. So, you guys can see that these are hubbed. These should be replaced. Uh, obviously this cleanout's messed up. The gasket's clearly shot. But management apparently does not want to pay for that. So we put it back the way we found it. There is so much stuff that I would love to be able to change, but we can't do anything unless we get approval. But when you're dealing with older companies, they don't want to spend the money if it's not a huge necessity, but you would think when you have water flooding in the garage, it would be a necessity, but apparently not. So, why don't I go show you guys where I think the blockage was? So, it comes along this pipe here. So it's this pipe here, right? I think it was either choked up here or it does do a little zigzag here. So it could have been anywhere there. And then it goes down there to the main building traps and storm and sanitary. And it goes from there. We've had that thing flood out a ton of times. So I want to thank you guys for watching. Until next time, this has been Jay, that drain guy, signing out. Taragna.